In Prodigy 4.2.0, you are now able to use Prodigy to connect to proxy servers. Proxy servers are often used in school networks or in enterprise networks uh, to increase security. So to connect to a proxy server, what you do in, in Prodigy is that you scroll to the settings application, select system, Wi-Fi setup, Wi-Fi networks, and then search in the list for your proxy uh, network. And then you'll be brought up to a new window which has uh, two options, either connect or advanced options. Before connecting to the server, you have to enter a couple of advanced options. So you click on the advanced options and this will bring you to another two options which is proxy none and then the IP settings. IP settings is always set to DHCP um, this, if you want to change, you will have to go in Android. Um, but if, you, if your network uses DHCP IP settings, then you're fine. Uh, so if you click on the proxy none option, this will show three other options. So none, manual, and proxy auto config. The proxy auto config, if selected, will ask you for the file name of your um, network configuration. So you can enter it here. And if you choose, instead of proxy auto config, if you choose manual, then uh, you will have to enter a name for your proxy host name, uh, either a name or a uh, IP address, depending on how your server is configured and also a proxy port, which is the port that you can use to access your uh, network. Once this information is entered, you go back and you click on connect and you should be able to see your uh, network, uh, your proxy network, as soon as uh, you connect it to it.